How you doing? Good, how are you? Excellent. Dateline correspondent Josh Mankiewicz. He has seen it all, so he's the perfect guy to talk about balloons. Just kidding, we're gonna talk about murder. How crazy is this Murdoch family saga in South Carolina? You following uh, this? We're on it. It's a great case. I got people asking me about it on social media all the time. In case you haven't heard, this is attorney and alleged embezzler Alex Murdoch. His wife and son were shot to death back in June. They don't know who the suspect is. They don't know who the suspects are. He found the bodies. Then earlier this month, Alex is changing a tire when someone drives by and shoots him in the head, but he survives. Investigators say he admitted he hired a former client to kill him so his other son could collect $10 million in life insurance. Murdoch just turned himself in today and faces a whole lot of charges. Josh? Somebody needs to say that, can I know about you hire someone to kill your wife, not you. <laughs> <laughs> can you believe he's a little dark, but the guy works at Dateline, so, you know. Why did the gunman him? not complete the job? He hired a crappy hitman. Josh? Said what I think is what everybody in the country is thinking. This is a story so crazy, it should be happening in Florida, but it's not. <laughs> Why don't people in Florida get upset when somebody says, oh, it should happen in Florida? Because they're still happy this one didn't happen in Florida. Florida man, you can sit this one out. I, I've got my popsicles ready for this dateline. Yeah. <laughs> um, Josh is a friend, and sometimes we've gone to dinner and we talk about murder methods. Do you two guys know how to party or what? <laughs> You're the best, Josh. Thank you. Good to see you.